Imagine, if you will, a world not bathed in the hyper-realistic, immersive graphics of today. Picture a time when the word GPU was not yet a part of the tech enthusiast's vocabulary, and the digital landscape was barren, its potential unexplored, its challenges unmet. This was the world of computer graphics in the late 1980s and early 90s, a world on the brink of a revolution. Computer graphics back then were primitive, to say the least. The industry was full of companies jostling for position, trying to push the boundaries of what was possible, yet falling short of the dream of true photorealistic graphics. This was the landscape that awaited three men who were about to change everything. Enter Jensen Huang, Chris Malakowski, and Curtis Prem, three visionaries who had cut their teeth in the high-stakes world of Silicon Valley, working at some of the most respected companies of the time. Their paths crossed at Sun Microsystems, a place where the trio got a front-row seat to the shortcomings and limitations of existing graphics technology. They were bold, they were ambitious, and they were about to start a journey that would redefine the world of computer graphics. They shared a dream, a vision of a world where graphics were not an afterthought, but a central part of the computing experience. A world where games and applications came to life in vibrant, realistic detail. In 1993, driven by this shared vision, they set up a small, unassuming company in Jensen Huang's sunny San Jose living room, a company they named NVIDIA, a term taken from the Latin root NVIDIA, meaning envy. But there was nothing to envy yet, just three innovators and their dream. With their considerable expertise and an unshakable belief in their vision, Huang, Malakowski and Prem were determined to overcome the challenges that lay ahead. Little did they know, they were about to kickstart a revolution, a revolution that would forever change the face of graphics, gaming and much more. In 1995, a mere two years after its inception, NVIDIA released the NEV1, its first product. Though the NV1 was not a commercial success, it was instrumental in setting the stage for what was to come. This graphics card was innovative for its time, featuring hardware acceleration for both 2D and 3D graphics. But there was a standout feature. The NV1 was unique in its use of quadratic texture maps. A technique that, while novel, failed to gain industry-wide acceptance. Yet it was not the success or failure of the NV1 that marked NVIDIA's journey. It was the learning, the refinement, the evolution. It was about the pursuit of a dream. And with the NV1, NVIDIA had taken its first steps. Fast forward to 1997 and the landscape of NVIDIA began to shift. The company launched the Reva 128, a product that was about to redefine NVIDIA's trajectory. This 128-bit graphics accelerator was a marvel of its time, featuring DirectX compatibility and capable of processing both 2D and 3D graphics on a single chip. It was a leap forward from the NV1, and the world started to take notice. The Reva 128, with its unparalleled performance, began to shape NVIDIA's position within the industry and the company's reputation as a front-runner in graphics technology. And as the 90s gave way to the brink of a new millennium, NVIDIA found itself standing at the threshold of an era-defining breakthrough. It was a moment that would set the stage for a game-changing invention. The Graphics Processing Unit, or GPU, the concept was groundbreaking, the impact monumental. In 1999, NVIDIA introduced the world to the GeForce 256, famously heralded as the first GPU. The name GeForce, symbolizing a force in geometry, was a fitting choice. The GeForce 256 was more than just a graphics card. It was a specialized processor designed to accelerate rendering of 3D graphics, capable of processing 10 million polygons per second. Its transformative power lay in its ability to offload work from the CPU, delivering unprecedented graphical performance and laying the foundation for the graphics-intensive applications we see today. By 2005, NVIDIA had not only survived the graphics revolution, but was leading it. 
With a clear vision and a commitment to innovation, the company was steering the course of the tech industry, shaping the way we interact with the digital world and forever transforming our understanding of what technology could achieve. But the NVIDIA story doesn't end here. It was merely the close of the first act in an ongoing saga of innovation and transformation. As NVIDIA carved its name deep into the tech annals, it was already setting its sights on a new frontier. A frontier far beyond the graphical arena that it had so expertly conquered. A turn of the tide was on the horizon. 2006 was the year NVIDIA broadened its horizons, bringing forth the Compute Unified Device Architecture, more commonly known as CUDA. CUDA was not merely an addition to NVIDIA's already impressive repertoire, but a paradigm shift. It was a whole new way of looking at the immense power concealed within the GPU, and it unlocked a door to a universe of possibilities that extended far beyond the realm of graphics. You see, Coda brought the world of parallel computing to the mainstream. It allowed developers to harness the raw power of the GPU for general-purpose computing. This enabled a colossal leap in performance across a range of applications, from scientific computing to machine learning, and it paved the way for NVIDIA's expansion into new and exciting markets. In 2007, NVIDIA launched the Tesla product line, high-performance computing GPUs, named after the Serbian inventor Nikola Tesla. Designed to accelerate scientific and data center workloads, Tesla GPUs have powered some of the world's fastest supercomputers. These powerhouses transformed computational research and made their mark in the world of AI and deep learning, opening up a whole new chapter in NVIDIA's illustrious history. Just a year before, in 2006, the Quadro line of products had emerged, targeting professional designers and artists. These workstation-grade GPUs opened the door to GPU-accelerated professional design and animation, bringing a new level of detail and realism to fields like product design and film production. Fast forward to 2018, the company launched the Turing architecture, a leap forward that introduced groundbreaking technologies like real-time ray tracing and AI-powered graphics enhancement known as Deep Learning Supersampling or DLSS. DLSS, an AI rendering technology, uses the power of deep learning and AI to boost frame rates and create sharp, detailed images for games. It was a game changer, paving the way for smoother, more immersive gaming experiences and further demonstrating NVIDIA's commitment to revolutionizing the gaming industry. Simultaneously, Turing's real-time ray tracing transformed the graphics world once again, providing artists and developers with a tool to create incredibly realistic lighting, shadows and reflections. This technology often shortened to RTX after NVIDIA's line of ray tracing capable GPUs marked the dawn of a new era in graphics, an era where virtual worlds could mirror the real one with uncanny precision. But NVIDIA's aspirations stretched beyond gaming and graphics. In the same vein as the AI technologies they had been nurturing, the company turned its attention towards one of the most significant and complex challenges of our time, autonomous driving. In response, they launched the Drive platform, a scalable AI-driven solution for autonomous vehicles. NVIDIA Drive combines deep learning, sensor fusion, and surround vision to create a world-class platform for self-driving vehicles. It's a testament to NVIDIA's vision, demonstrating the company's capability to power not just our computers and games, but also the vehicles of the future. And as the present morphs into the future, NVIDIA stands poised to usher in the next era of technological innovation with its most recent Ampere architecture. Introduced in 2020, Ampere pushes the boundaries even further, delivering unmatched acceleration at every scale for AI, data science, and graphics. As NVIDIA's GPUs laid the groundwork for an AI revolution, a key aspect to highlight is the impact of their technology on AI applications that are becoming mainstream, such as natural language processing, computer vision, and machine learning. The rise of AI platforms like ChatGPT is a testament to the power of NVIDIA's contributions. However, the mainstreaming of AI isn't confined to text-based applications like ChatGPT. 
NVIDIA's technologies are equally significant in the realms of computer vision and machine learning. Autonomous vehicles, facial recognition systems, and even healthcare diagnostics employ AI models powered by NVIDIA's hardware and software solutions, transforming industries and enhancing lives. From gaming to AI and beyond, NVIDIA continues to break barriers, pushing the envelope on what's possible.